Danielle are gonna Danielle and I are gonna go do a couple of uh, errands. I have a couple of Sensi orders that I need to mail off, um, and then uh, Sensi return, and then her Amazon books uh, that she rented. So if you guys did not know, um, you can rent college books on Amazon. So if they're able to rent it, that's not something that they want to keep as far as like the books. I have them rent it. Um, and I think it's like, how much did you rent your books for? Like $30 was the maximum. 30. No, I rented the books that I only had one book to rent and that mm -hmm. was, it was like $13. And I, I wanted to keep a book because, um, those for my major. Mm -hmm. So that's the only one that I bought and that one was like $40. Oh, okay. Yeah. So if you guys were not aware of that, you can rent books through Amazon, which is really helpful. Um, especially I have two college students. I have a junior and then a freshman and it helps out because when I went to college, I remember like college books cost like 200, 300 kind of dollars and then it's ridiculous. So if you're able to rent, go for it. Um, let me show you what I need to do. Sorry, dishwasher's running, but I have um, some orders to drop off, mail off kind of thing. So then I uh, give samples. Um, this is my order gift. Um, they don't, they have no Christmas scent. So I have, you know, like it says, um, dip three cotton balls into dish with hot wax to clean for the Scentsy. And then I have a couple of samples, very uh, snowy spruce. I have marshmallow, mint cocoa, like my favorite scent, silver bells. So they wanted like a Christmassy scent. I think I'm gonna get blueberry cheesecake, put two of them as well as a sample. And, um, um, I I ordered another one at, home, at Joanne's, not Home Depot, Joanne's. I had purchased this at the store, gosh, a month or maybe two months ago. I ordered another one at Joanne's, but guess what? Joanne says we no longer have it in inventory after waiting a few weeks. And so I'm just stuck with one. So I'm gonna go ahead and have Happy, Happy put that on display. I got this from Danielle's uh, boyfriend. Really nice, uh, huge um, pot. And then I'm using it as a, um, uh, what do you call that? As a center for my table, doing dishes, laundry kind of thing. And then just gonna go ahead and drop these off and then go get, um, go to Costco because we're gonna drop off some flowers uh, to Danielle's uh, family. Um, and Boyfriend's that's it. Family. Huh? Boyfriend's family. Oh, what did I say? To my family. Oh, to we're gonna go to, we're gonna go to Costco, get flowers to drop off flowers to Danielle's boyfriend's family. <laughs> really quick, I wanted to show you guys this. I made my own caramel sauce. the hot cocoa bombs and then also because we have um, ice cream that the kids love and hubby's last night was like there's no sauce there's no caramel sauce so i made some caramel um sauce and this is a uh, caramel sauce so it doesn't it's not as thick it's a little bit like um like, it's a sauce <laughs> it's supposed to pour over it's very easy to make but you do have to have a candy uh, thermometer otherwise it's, it's a bit harder Okay, few stops today. So I went to the kids' uh, school, the younger kids, the two kids, Danica and Danilin, and got them a laptop because they've been using their own personal laptops. Well, Danica has been using Jonathan's older laptop and it's just so much easier for them to just get a school computer so that uh, with Danny's issue is that she has her games onto her laptop, personal laptop. So then it's kind of hard as far as like a study habit. So with the school laptop then that's all it's intended for when um she's in school is that there's no video games in there there's no personal information in there that she can uh kind of get distracted so well, this one it's uh one and a quarter curling iron twenty dollars off this is the 61 and then Costco and then this one $99, $30 off so then it's $69 so I'm gonna get that and then oh my gosh and then socks for the kids and then instead of going to the um, floral shop I'm just gonna get this one and then this one's for hubby for his back 
10, like $11. One and then, and then this one. Okay, waiting on Danielle. She's wanting to look for a gift for Antonio. This special event at Costco, so there's Seattle. Um, another Seattle, but look at this one. Beach Life. Lighthouse, welcome sign. How pretty. It's made of um, metal. I'm liking this one. It's Aloha. Merry Christmas. I'm like, what are they? And then, and then this is where they have them. All right, we have a lot. <laughs> uh, oh, you know what? Hot cocoa mix already. Ten bucks. That's what I was in here for as well for my hot cocoa bomb. So this is classic for ten dollars, and then peppermint, nine dollars. Peppermint is always good. Okay, friends, it is now dark. <laughs> Look how dark it is. It's four thirty, and I still have one more stop to go. So I was able to go to the dollar store and get a bunch of tin containers for cookies and hot cocoa bombs to be able to give to teachers and friends. And then uh, some families. Uh, no orders. I'm not doing any orders of those. And but although everybody is asking about my chocolate chip cookie recipe, which I just say it's just it's Martha Stewart. I think the the thing with chocolate chip cookies is if you have a good chocolate chip cookie that is not dry, that's more like um like chewy um chewy and soft, then you're able to just add on whatever you want to add on to it and then it'll taste really really good. And then so I have like huge I have a re I did have a recipe before of a chocolate chip cookie recipe, but it was it had oatmeal, so it becomes dry if you add other stuff to it that I noticed. But I actually did do that for quite a while. And Danielle is just dropping off uh, flowers and candies that we bought uh, for her boyfriend's family. And I got a Sensi order that I need to mail off, a UPS, and then uh, that's about it. All right, friends, we, we are home. <laughs> we are home, but uh, we didn't do one stop, and that was um, mailing off a... Uh, sensi order because going into the post office there was a line that was on the main road and then the parking lot was like jam-packed like there was I did not see a space to be able to park that's why the the line of cars was all the way to the main road and then there was a long line outside the post office um, door so it is now almost five I'm gonna head out again because I need to pick up a CVS uh, picture order for Danny. And I'm going to try to go there at 8 o'clock. And hoping that, um, hoping that I, can, I can mail off the, the Sensi order. Uh, it was just too, too packed. And so let me go ahead and show you really quick. Okay, so this is what I got. Um, also part of Costco was this one. This was only like $10. Hey, Danica. <laughs> I also got her that jacket. Um, this one, I think I want to say it was $10. It was like clear and stock because it had a zero zero ending. So not bad for a big four pound. We also currently have this. So this is perfect for the peppermint um, hot cocoa bomb because it's already um, pepper minty inside. I also wanted to go to Costco for this one, the hot cocoa Starbucks. So it's a more flavorful hot cocoa uh, bomb. And then I got these over at the dollar store, this one. Um, I can put um, little stuff in here like this is the teacher's gift so hubby picked this up for me um, Ray Dunn a few months ago for um, I knew knowing that it was going to be for one of the kids teachers and then this is for <laughs> her as well this is a Scentsy counter clean I have this Danica is always telling her that um, when she wipes off her whiteboard it smells like candy cane and she did say oh my gosh really because I don't like the smell of the one I use I'd love to have one of those so um, I'm going to surprise her with this one and then also I'm giving her a Scentsy mini fan diffuser that um, there's a USB plug in here that she can just plug into her laptop and then it uses one of these um, Scentsy pod and this is a vanilla mint. Okay, that's for her Danica's teacher along with um, popcorn. This is really good. 
and then um, I have this one for four hot uh, cocoa bombs I know that she doesn't have younger kids but she does have two college students so herself her husband and then the two kids and then this one is for my cookie so since there's four of them in the family i think i will use the bigger one for my um, giant chocolate chip cookies that i posted a few weeks ago so that and then along with that so family gifts for her family uh, to enjoy and then her uh, personal gift and then i'm gonna cover the basket at the bottom uh, from again from the dollar store uh, with these ones all right and then i did another bag so i have three of the other one that i showed you and then this is the first one of this one which is going to be peppermint chai latte strawberries and cream and then the white chocolate matcha so then everyone has uh, one of each kind of thing <laughs> for my teacher for um her two uh two teachers okay Nick Tommy. yes and miss davis all right so yeah so we're gonna go ahead and finish it up i made the ones i showed you guys on the vlog those were like samples for the family and then i made more and then those are also um like samples for like lola and such and then i made a brand new batch with um uh for gifting um just to see how it was going to be at first and that was i actually did the vlog like two days ago two or three days ago so this was done today so really like it it's really quick once you go into the process. So I, I like to make my shells first and then I can um, start decorating. And then I just do like the white chocolate first and then the, the, the dark chocolate. So then all is just, it's like an assembly line. <laughs> what are you doing? Eating the, um, the leftover ones? Okay, uh -huh. don't touch these ones. Okay, mm -hmm. these are all done. I have them a ditch. Um, yeah, those are, yeah, those are hard though. Yeah, those are for trash now, but if you want to try it, yeah. I and even this one, these are trashed. We're all done with those. Whoa. Okay, so Danica is going to do a puppet show. Okay, mm -hmm. we're going to be over here, right here. All right, everybody's having ice cream, except for Danny and I. Hey, waiting on Danica. Let us know when you're ready. It's part of her assignment. The, the little old lady and the little old man want to make a gingerbread. So the big put in the oven, and then the gingerbread just pop out in one way. Oh, nice. Who are the characters? Good job, Danica. I don't want to be a gingerbread man when I grow up. I'll get eaten by a fox. <laughs> or a kid. Or a kid. <laughs> you want to show us all the characters over here, baby? Okay, she did it all by herself today. So here's her book that she read today. Okay. I got an idea about okay. well, I'll use it one of the details. Okay. okay. All right. So who are the characters? Okay. So you the old lady. Oh dear lord. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll be the young man. No, you're the uh, Oh, we're together. We're the old couple. 
<laughs> I'm the I'm the old fat man. <laughs> I'm the old fat lady. Look at that body type. Oh Look at that body. I need to go for a run. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. And I get to wait her. A horse? I'm a horse. Oh, nice. Okay. And Tia, you're not the right one. <laughs> you're the fox. <laughs> it's the fox. Oh, it's perfect. There's how many? Six. Okay. Which one's D? Which one's D? <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna get gobbled up. We're gonna bake you. <laughs> you're the cow. Oh, you did such a good job, Danica. It was your first puppet show. Yes. Were you Bow. nervous? No. Oh. <laughs> A little, a little bit. bit. You did good. Bow.